You could also do this. See ya, bitch. Bye. My consciousness fades. Oh my goodness. It's uh it's Dragon's Dogma. Dark Arisen. Look at that. Look at that little dragon in the back there. I actually initially bought this back when I had a PS3 because I wanted like a I was in need of hack and slashes. And Oh no, he oh he breathed in fire on me. Oh hold on. I'll finish my thought afterwards. Oh god. Get out of here, goblin. I'm trying to, man. Oh, take that, you stupid goblin. Okay, let's get out of here. Let's just get out of here. Uh, oh boy. I was in need of hack and slashes, and this just kind of popped up on the, uh, on the Amazon page. Amazon store page. And I was like, oh, this looks pretty good. And I saw the gameplay, and I was like, oh, wow, this actually looks really cool. I had a fucking blast with it. It was amazing. It was, uh, it was exactly what I wanted out of, uh, out of an RPG. Although, at the time, unfortunately, though, the, uh, the PS3 was not the most powerful system. But now you get to play it on PC. Now it's on PC. It's all fancy... 60 FPS, full resolution. I mean, it's a crazy time, man. It's a crazy time to be alive. Get these damn harpies out of here. I'm, I'm trying to, my man, but you're slowing me down. Get out of here, harpy. So yeah, right now we're playing as the, uh, the Arisen, or the old Arisen. I forget exactly who this gentleman is, but... This isn't going to be our main character. We're going to be, uh, we're going to be switching in a little bit. First, we got to get through this just to sort of learn the ropes, learn how to use the controls. Oh, you little, you dick bag. Get out of here, you goblin fucker. Okay, there we go. Oh, there's another harpy. Get out of here, you damn harpy. Okay. Oh, there's another one. Get out of here. Go away. I'm trying to... Okay, there we go. Yeah, unfortunately, this game doesn't have a borderless window mode. At least, I don't think it does. So, alt-tabbing is a bit of a pain. That's always how it ends up. There's always that one option that's missing. Ooh, liquid vim. Nice. I'll take that. Let's go, guys. Let's go to the promised land. Beyond that. Oh no! Oh no, he popped in! Look at that chimera, he's got a little goat on him. Oh, that poor... That poor soldier. Oh no, he got eated. Oh well, not my problem. Uh oh. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> God damn it. Oh, oh no, goat head. No, I'm trying to- I'm tr Oh, oh, I'm so dead. I'm dead. Oh, heal me. Heal me, my minions. Thank you. Oh. I- I- I'll be there in a second. I just need- I just need a little bit of time to recover. I can't. I can't. I'm sorry. Okay, now I can go. Okay. Oh, yeah, you can climb on them. Uh, so this game is a little bit like... If, uh, Shadow of the Colossus, Devil May Cry, and Dark Souls had a child. And uh, it doesn't really succeed in a lot of aspects. Oh, I'm dead. Oh, I'm actually dead. But it doesn't really matter. We're supposed to die anyway. It, yeah, it doesn't really succeed in a lot of aspects. Um, but it doesn't fail either. It's not, it's not a bad game. I would not say that this game is bad by any means. This is an amazing game and if any of you have not played it, I would highly recommend that you skip this and go play this game right now. Skip this playthrough that I'm doing, go play it for yourselves and then come back. Then we can, then we can talk, okay? Oh, look at that dragon. I wonder if he's gonna be important. 
Probably not. There's a lot of harpies. I never noticed the I never noticed the amount of harpies that were flying around him. Uh I don't know if I don't know why specifically there's harpies flying around him, but maybe maybe there's a lore reason as to why that is. So this is Alduin. He's uh he's traveled back from the past uh millions of years in order to find the arisen and uh claim his throne. Uh, we'll we'll learn a bit more about him though as the story goes on. So don't you worry about that. Oh, he ate one of them. Oh, you silly dragon. You so crazy. All right, here we go. We're in the character creator. Uh, let's see. Male or female? Let's go with female. Let's see. Uh, let's see what female takes us to. Enter a name. Let's see. I'm going to try to not make this stupid. I'm going to try to take this as serious as possible. Yep. Crumpus. That's their name. Oh, and then we get a moniker. Uh, what do we got? What do we got to work with and see? Uh, there's Chabu. Chabu is very tempting. There's also... Oh, there's Choco. Chun-Li. <laughs> okay. Uh, oh yeah, Capcom. That would that would make sense. That would actually make very very much sense. Uh, what? Cloth Hilt? <laughs> what? Cloth Hilt? Uh, I think I might have to go with that one actually. Cloth Hilt is looking pretty. A uh, Crocodilia? What are these names? What are these names, my man? I'm gonna have to go with Crocodilia. I'm sorry, Crumpus, but that's your new nickname. Uh, let's see. What frame do we want? We need a we need a very strong female protagonist. You know, she's she's been through some shit. Oh my Jesus of Christ. Jesus of Christ. That is a Ooh, oh boy. The years have not been kind to you, Crumpus. Uh, no, we need a, we need a very, oh, this one, this one kind of works, actually. Kind of like this one. Uh, let's pick a voice. Oh, God, no. Nope, 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 let's go with, um, I kind of like that one. It's very, hmm, uh, let's go with that one. That's very tough. That's a very tough voice. Let's see, let's change the hair a bit. What do we got to work with? Uh, oh, I kind of like that one. Oh, but I also like that one. Uh, maybe we can get her some longer hair. Let's see. Oh, or the ponytail. Ponytail's actually pretty nice. You know what? I think I might go with the, the ponytail. kind of like that one. Uh, it's very boring. Very boring colors. Let's go with... I'm going to go with red. I'm gonna go with red. Stature. Let's just make her really tall. Uh, that's fine. Skin color. I kind of like that. I kind of like that. And then build musculature. Oh no, that is a little bit too. That is a little bit too bulky. Let's just let's just leave it there. Kind of like uh, kind of like this one. I'm gonna go with this one. Oh yeah, good viewer expressions. <laughs> that, God, that face. Uh, yeah, that's good. This is our this is our lady right here, Crumpus. Let's go battle. Let's go fight some dragons. Leave a comment. Leave a comment down below if you're excited. If you're excited to see the adventures of Crumpus, because uh, I'm pretty sure it's gonna be a doozy. Oh, there she is. <laughs> oh, oh, look at all that. Look at all those graphics. Look at that lens flare. Ah, it's too bright. Ah, jeez. God. Oh, there's uh, what's her face? I forget her name, but I think she's important. Oh, no. Whatever could that be? Hope it's not a dragon, because that would be a, that'd be very bad. It's, it's 
Oh, god damn it. What did I just say? I just said it better not be a dragon. Come on, dragon. Let's go. Let's go toe to toe. You and me. I can take you. I've fought things before. Uh oh. He's actually a lot bigger than I than I remembered. Oh no! Get the children out of here! Get them out of here, damn it! Crumpus, don't do it! You don't know what you're getting yourself into! Oh no! Uh oh. Oh, now we gotta fight a dragon. Great. Oh, he's charging up his his powerful beams. Oh no. Oh, they're all dead. Oh, <laughs> instantly died. <laughs> instantly died. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> that wasn't supposed to happen. You were supposed to actually fight him for a bit, but I just instantly got vaporized by his fire. <laughs> God damn it, man. <laughs> oh, now he's all pissed because we stabbed him with our tiny sword. I'm pretty sure nothing bad will happen, though. He'll probably just let us go. Oh, no. Oh, that's not good. Oh, he took our heart. Oh, that monster. Give it back. Give me back my heart. I kind of need that. I need that to live, bro. I, I'm pretty sure there's supposed to be subtitles here, but there's not. <laughs> No, he ate our heart. You monster. God damn you. Get out of here. Stupid dragon. Stupid dragon's dogma. Dragon's dogma. This song is very... There's like a... There's like a hint of like... Something off about it. That I... That I love. Like it doesn't... It doesn't sound correct in a few aspects but it's catchy and then like <laughs> sometimes like when i'm doing things it'll play in my head in the background and i'm like oh man i don't want to i don't want to have to start up dragon zogma again i don't want to drop everything i'm doing just to play that game and listen to this song but i do anyway <laughs> take, up arms. take up arms but i have my arms I have both of my arms, actually. It's time to begin our journey. We Look at us. Wow, you actually move pretty damn fast. I forgot how fast you move in this game. Uh, so what are we going to be? Are we going to be a, a dagger boy? Are we going to be a sword boy? Are we going to be a, a staff boy? Uh, let's see. Strider would be very broken in the long run. Mage, maybe. But I think I'm going to have to go with fighter. At least for right now. At least for right now. You say it left a glowing scar? Yes. The wound has closed. And it seems the worst has passed. But her heart lies silent. Hey, Kina. You should be a bed. I wish you would not strain yourself so. I'm worried for you, cuz. Cuz... Oh, wait, so does that mean... Oh, I guess that means we can't... Oh, this is, uh... This changes things a bit. I'll keep you in mind, just in case we're, like, really, really, really distant cousins. Okay, what's in here? Cloud wine. Uh, isn't there something... Hold on. There's a, there's a thing here, isn't there? Like... Over on this side? No, you can go down there. That's fine. Yeah, there's like a little cave. Oh, there's this. Forgot about this. Oh, got a coin pouch. Ooh. Thousand bucks, huh? Like here. Lamica. Okay, was that it? Yeah, seems like that's about it. Uh, oh, no, it's not it. There's another little cave right here. Oh, okay. Very sneaky. What is this? What can I what can I gather from this? Oh, okay. Okay, got some freebies. That's good. 
All right, cool. So, uh, Dragon's Dogma just shit the bed when I all tapped. <laughs> that was, uh, that was fun. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> where, where was I? What were we doing? Oh, that's right. Did I already collect the stuff down here? I, I don't know what it saved or didn't save. So I'm going to check again. Nope. Didn't save any of this. What happened? It just like, <laughs> it's just like minimized for some reason. Oh boy, this game does not play well with the, uh, with alt tabbing. Oh boy. Oh, wait a minute. I got money from this before. Hold on. No, I got money from this before, didn't I? What is this bullshit? Oh, that sucks. That sucks ass. <laughs> that sucks, man. Oh, I got like a thousand bucks from that. And now it's just gone. Uh, I don't know what I was talking about before, but anyway, this is Dragon's Dogma. Uh, look at it. Look at it in all its glory. So this game is very... Like, when this game first released, it was very, uh... It released around the same time as Dark Souls, I want to say. And people kind of had the assumption that it was, like, a, a Dark Souls-type game. But it really wasn't. It was more of, like... A Devil May Cry RPG, if that makes any sense. It's very uh, fast-paced, very hack and slashy. You know, the it wasn't like the slow, methodical type of gameplay that you'd find in Dark Souls. It was very much its own thing. Although the uh, the expansion, um, well, what is it? The the whatever the expansion was. I'll put I'll put the name of it up on screen right now right here that did actually have a dark souls feeling to it just because it was more dungeon crawly than anything uh it was very uh like you had to watch your back you had to like really pay attention to your surroundings in that uh dlc that in and of itself was very much what i think people initially thought this game was going to be i'm uh, probably not going to get all the secrets probably not going to get all the the hidden valuables, but I'm just gonna have fun playing the game. Do what I do what I want. We'll just kind of see where it goes from there. It's unfortunate that this game came out in the uh, in the PS3 era, or the like that whole generation of consoles because it's so like the game is meant to be fast paced and you know very action oriented. When it came out initially. Unfortunately, the the consoles just could not really handle what this game wanted to be. That kind of skewed people's expectations of of the game. We all knew the dragon was coming. Yeah, and I fended him off. I stabbed him in his little hand. The faith can keep their prophecies. The dragon always comes around, sure as the seasons. Uh, okay. You look well, John. Shut up. Let's see, what can I buy? What can I buy? Oh, airtight flasks. I remember these being pretty useful, actually. What's your what's your conundrum? I would not ask this of anyone but you, cousin. I have news for Merin. Dark news. I fear I cannot bring myself to face him. Will you go in my stead? Okay. Uh just make sure to give me some money afterwards. His brother is dead. Oh. It happened on the shore ways. Um, uh, uh, maybe, yeah, I, I'd still like that money, though. We were fleeing the worm, and he, Cortez, leapt before the beast talons to shield us. Well, I got my heart ripped out by a dragon, so, you know, we're, we're all in the same boat together. Please, please go and tell him. All right, I'll go and tell him. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, what's your deal, Padre? Oh, I can help you with. It is selfish to beg a favor in such times, I know, but there is aught I would ask your help in. Okay. Might we speak a moment? Privately. Uh, I mean, we're speaking right now. My, I welcome the chance to be of use, but my scriptures are missing. Oh, that's bad. I have yet to commit the verses to memory. Without the text, I, I cannot offer up a proper prayer. Uh, so you want me to come up with the text for you? Okay, I can make up some prayers. I can do that. The scriptures were secure in the chapel last I saw them. I do not wish to believe them stolen. Oh, you want me to get the scriptures. Never mind then. If you come upon them, 
pray see them back to me. I would be ever in your debt. Uh, sure, buddy. I don't really know where I'd find the scriptures, though. Uh, uh whatever. We'll, we'll probably find them. It shouldn't be too difficult. Hey, dude. What's your deal? What's up? Twas me. I confess it. I took the father's book from the chapel. That's not good, kid. You should give it back to him. I just wanted to look at it. Just curious is all. Um, okay, well... Give me. I cannot remember where I lost it. Oh, you dickbag. Why do I have to do everything around here? I'd put to steal a glance and then return it, but the dragon came and I... I dropped it as I ran. Cole, what am I to say to him now? Tell him you lost it, you dingus. Uh, wasn't there something... Can I just tell him that? Can I tell the, uh... Can I tell you that information? Can I tattletale? I am newly, but now I cannot think the script. Oh, never mind. I can't tell on him. I was gonna rat him out. I was gonna sell his soul to the devil for a quick buck, but it didn't work out that way. Yeah. So this game is also very vertical. You can do a lot of climbing, a lot of uh, parkour. Well, I shouldn't say parkour. You can do a lot of climbing. Uh, you can get up on surfaces. Get a better vantage point, find some secrets, find some hidden areas. Uh, it's very interesting in that aspect. Oh yeah, the notice boards. So yeah, you can also take up uh, little quests, little side quests on the, uh, the notice boards. Usually these things are like slay X amount of this or do this amount of Y. And you're probably gonna complete them as you go along from area to area so you know try to pick up what you can but there are some escort missions too like you can take a npc from one area to another although those can be those can be very very uh, risky because npcs can actually die in this game uh and once they're dead they're dead <laughs> you give me a quest what I shall go and put Elvar at ease. You're welcome, my man. Okay. That's one task done. Oh, you also have a mission for me. Can you fetch the flowers I need from outside the village? I can do that. I can do that very easily. I need more of the one you see there. And one other sort besides. What are you talking about, lady? The more you can find, the better. I can't really see what you're talking about. Are you talking about these herbs right here? I've got some info for you. I thank you, cousin. I live the best I am able, for his sake. Okay, 300 gold, huh? That's, uh, that's very generous of you, but... You know what? It's fine. It's fine. I'm not gonna... Oh, here's the scriptures right here. I found them. I found them all on my own, guys. Aren't you proud of me? Oh, I couldn't grab that, really. Hey, dude, here's your scriptures. I am newly come and eager to become part of it. What did you just say? You're newly come? What was that about come? Here's your scriptures, dude. The scriptures. You found them. Oh, maker be praised. Yep. Well, I mean, you should praise me because I'm the one who found them. But I have dallied long enough. There is work for me to do. Uh, 300, huh? That's, uh... It's very generous of you, but, um, kind of had to go out of my way to find those. Just saying, buddy. Just saying. Yeah, one thing I do like about this game, uh, it's not, it's not, like, randomly generated. It's not like, uh, Oblivion or something where enemies are just, like, randomly populated throughout the map. Everything is exactly where it is every time you play it. Well, kind of. I mean, they do they do move around, obviously, and they're in somewhat different positions, but they're generally the same enemy. Also, people can die. You could just... Somebody could just die, and, you know, if that person is a quest giver, oh well. He's just dead for that playthrough. I think there's a few NPCs that can't be killed simply because of where they're placed, but generally, like, you can just... You can just kill anybody, and sometimes those actions have consequences. Uh, let's go, let's go get this, get this show on the road. Let's go over here. Well, look what's over here, guys. 
Oh no, what's this mysterious black hole in the middle of the, uh, the area? I wonder what that could be. I hope his name isn't Rook. I really hope his name isn't Rook, because that would boil my salami. Before leaving, this God damn it, you son of a bitch. Come here. I'm gonna throw you into the goddamn well. Oh, I can't do that yet. You have these pawns that other users can create, and then they can then rent out their pawns, and you can rent them, and then you can use them in your party. And you can mix and match and have different leveled pawns, different uh, types of pawns. Like, it's a very it's a very unique system, and I really, really love it because it does two things that I really enjoy. One, it lets me create a silly little character. Uh, two, it also gives me this pseudo party that I can just run around with and wreak havoc. And I really enjoy that. Uh, let's see. Let's, uh, let's go see what's down the road here. Damn. Oh no, Raynard! He's in trouble! Let's get these damn goblins off of him. Okay, okay. Uh, yeah. Uh, come here, stupid goblin. I don't want to actually hit Raynard because there's affinity in this game. Uh, certain NPCs can, you know, start to dislike you if you do any silly things with them. And like I mentioned earlier, Raynard can just die. He can just die here. And he's just gone for the rest of the game. Which would suck because he's actually pretty fucking useful in the later, t in the later part of the game. That was far too close. So you don't want that happening? But thanks to you, it was only wares I lost. I'll consider it a bargain. You have my thanks. Oh, you're welcome. Oh, and he gave us a leather cap. Or leather cape. Bye, Raynard. See ya. Uh, let's go. Let's try to find those flowers for what's her face. What's her face, McGee? I don't remember what her name was. In this game, you can't, like, go too far out in the sea because... The Loch Ness Monster will get you and drag you into his depths. Uh, I don't remember the lore reason as to why it is that happens, but it does happen. So don't don't go swimming in the water too deep. Oh, yeah, rabbits. Oh, also. Oh, what happened? What happened? What happened there? <laughs> what did I, th <laughs> I don't know what happened there. I think I just got stuck in like a falling animation. That's so weird. <laughs> Give me fire. Give me fire, my dude. Oh, how did that blink strike miss? Oh, never mind. Never mind. Oh, boy. Oh, these guys are very tanky. Hold on. Hold on. Wait a second here. I don't remember you guys being this tanky. Uh, <laughs> okay, never mind. You know what? Maybe we won't be fighting the goblins. We're just gonna we're just gonna ignore the goblins for a little bit. Uh yeah, no, no, we're not gonna be doing that. Okay, let me just get these flowers. Let me just get these dang darn flowers. You guys probably can't see a whole lot of things because it's very dark right now. But just know that I am running like a child from danger. Oh, does he? Oh, that missed, really? Okay. Oh, sup, dude? I never talked to you. I have Benita has you picking flowers for her. I trust in your judgment. Okay. You come by the inn. You can always rest until. Yeah, I yeah, yeah. I get it. I get it. Uh, I'm actually gonna rest until morning, and then, and then I'm just gonna try to deposit some of my stuff. What can I do you for? As you will. Uh, cause in this game, okay, so in this game you have. You have like consumables. You have a lot of consumables. And some of those consumables, like meat and berries and stuff, they can actually rot. They can actually go bad if you leave them in your in your uh, pockets for long enough. Uh, so you either have to use an airtight flask to keep them fresh, or you have to deposit them into the uh, at the inn. So if you're n if you're not going to be using it like right away, meat and berries. And stuff like that, you generally want to put it away as soon as possible. 
So yeah, you wanna you wanna be paying attention to your inventory and what you're picking up because you it's uh it might not seem like it, but there's gonna be a time when you need a little item, like a simple item, like a fish or something, uh, to complete a quest, and then you go, Oh yeah, I have a fish, and then you look in your inventory and it's just rotted. I think the iron sword is the one we have, right? Oh no, actually we don't even have iron swords we have a rusted sword uh i might as well just go with the trusty sword i think the leather belt might be a good balance because i have some good magic defense and i got some better defenses i'm gonna go with the leather belts oh and a pickaxe uh i should probably yeah i'm gonna get a pickaxe too because pickaxe is very important for mining some materials Rabbits, I'm sorry, rabbits, but I need you for a quest. Oh, I completed a quest. Uh, one cool thing about the notice boards, you don't actually have to go back to the notice board to turn them in. The specific ones you do, but for the most part, you just complete it and then that's it. You get the reward then and there. So like early on, you want to try to kill things when you can because more often than not, they're part of a uh, a quest of some kind. Oh, so I already have the flowers. Okay, cool. Uh, all right then, we can go back and uh, give them to What's-Her-Face McGee. All right, I'll probably do like some sort of really cool transition, like a really cool wipe to go back to her. And you'll see that right now. Oh, wow. Wasn't that transition really cool? Aren't you guys proud of me? Hey, talk to me. You brought the rest of them, have you? All that remains is to find some moon glow. A pinch mixed with these will make a fine medicine. Oh, I have to find the moon glow too? Oh, man. Uh, ooh. That means I have to do night stuff. I'm gonna go play the rest of the game. There's a whole world to explore. Look at this world, by the way. I haven't I haven't even touched on the world yet. I just love the, uh, just everything about this game and how it looks. It's very, it's very colorful. It's very full of life. It's just a nice, cozy place. Other than the, the dragons and the goblins, but like, the, the, you know, that's such a minor thing about this game. It's like, uh, tornadoes or, I don't know floods they just they're just there oh no there's a dude talking in my ear i know the way master follow me oh uh, this is mercedes she's probably one of my favorite characters in this game uh you'll find out more about her later on but for the most part she's like she's not good at her job i think she's very uh she has trouble like being good at her job and that's like, that's gonna be playing a major role in her quests later on. Uh, oh yeah, I can learn skills from you. Can I, do I have any new skills to learn? Got Toss Tuss, got Brass Cuss, got Sky Cuss. Let's do this thing. Well met, sir. Can you hear our voice? Yes, it's very loud in my ear, actually. If you would claim to be among the Arisen, prove the strength of your resolve. I'm very strengthy. I faced a dragon and stabbed him in his hand. I think that's pretty heroic, if you ask me. Oh, I need to do a trial? Okay. I can do that. I can do that very easily, too. Uh, search the area, huh? Is that what you want me to do, Gabe? I'm gonna save. I'm gonna save and continue. Save my progress, damn it. Yeah, so there's pawns that wander around and you can kind of, you can kind of spot them a little bit and they'll be wandering around and you can, you know, rent them. They'll be out in the world too. Like you could just meet one uh, just roaming the open area. And if you need somebody in your party, you could just rent them right then and there. And it's really cool. Uh, sometimes, though, depending on their level, they're very 
very expensive. Like, like really expensive. What did you guys want me to do? The beast comes. Hurry. The beast. What beast? I don't see a beast. I see a gate. What are you talking about? What are you talking about, Willis? Is that reference dated? I don't think so. I think the I think the kids still say that. Probably. <laughs> Probably not. <laughs> oh, look at that Cyclops. Look at him. He's so ferocious. I don't know. I'm just I'm a sucker for this game. Like, I'm I'm into the whole like generic high fantasy kind of thing. Like Cyclops and Chimeras. Obviously, they've been done to death, but like, I don't know, man. It's just, uh oh, uh, this is probably a bad idea. Oh, that was a very bad idea. But yeah, like, I'm just a sucker for, uh, for these like fantasy games, and I'm a sucker for, um, oh, Rook, oh, you stupid, oh, you fucking idiot. I just saved you, my dude. Oh, ho, 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 ho. never mind. I'm the stupid. Oh boy, uh, <laughs> let's uh, yeah, yeah, Rook is just dead, by the way. Uh, so pawns in this game, they kind of have a timer. If they get downed, you can actually pick them back up to revive them. But if you leave them for too long, they're just, they're just dead. And you have to, you have to like go back to the, uh, the little pawn statue to revive them i can't dude you're like you're actually in an area i can't get to <laughs> i'm sorry man you're just fucked probably should have been that close to the edge uh oh god there we go i can't help you man you're too far off the edge sorry look at his butt look at his butt jiggle yeah, man, I, I... Wait, where are you, even? Oh, you're over here. How'd you get over here? I thought you were off the cliff or something. So, yeah, puns, they can easily die. Like, a monster can just, like, one-shot them. And then you have to, like, make the decision to either go out of your way to revive them or just, you know, carry on. It's not, like, a, a huge urgency if they do die. But it can be in certain situations, and those situations can make or break uh, a fight. You could also do this. See ya, bitch. Bye. My consciousness fades. So I think I'm going to call it here, guys. Uh, next time, we're going to go create our pawn. We're going to go on some adventures. Maybe even go to a city. You know, who knows? The who knows? The world is our oyster, as they say. But that won't be until next time. Anyway, see ya. Bye. <laughs>